Hey everyone, it's Natalie Zafat, and today I'm chatting with Maria Lensing, VP of Healthcare at AT&T, about how hospitals can prepare for 5G and mitigate security risks. AT&T and Rush University Medical Center have just implemented the first ever 5G hospital. What do you think 5G will be able to do for hospitals that couldn't be done before? The promise of 5G is a significant upspeed in speed, and I, I honestly think most people don't understand that because of how significant a change it is compared to the experiences we've had from 3G to 4G. But if you think of an MRI, such a big file coming seamlessly from a device, how is that going to allow us to do communications between the nurse, the doctors, and the patient in the future? How about augmented reality and virtual reality in the operating theater? Can that help from a training perspective? Can we do something there? Those are the type of applications we're looking to test. Maria, what do hospitals need to do to prepare for 5G? Start thinking about the connectivity platform that they need to create, and 5G is just one element of that. But the truth is, all of this technology, all of this connectivity platform has to allow for the flexibility to allow innovations that are coming into the healthcare space to reside and come quickly into the environments that our healthcare ecosystem is bringing. What advice would you have for hospitals and administrators who are looking to embrace digital transformation but want to mitigate security risks? One, they're vulnerable. They have precious data that people are after. Two, threat on the mobility side, and especially with these IoT things that are coming, it's prevalent and it's an area that they know is vulnerable. So get ahead of it. And then three, right, seek help. That understand kind of what's out there, know that you have precious target and partner with people that know this space well to help you design how to go about combating it. For more videos like this, subscribe to our channel.